Do you want to learn how to switch between MIUI 10 stable and beta on your Xiaomi Poco F1 with a locked bootloader? That's what we're going to do in this video. If you haven't already subscribed, make sure you subscribe to the channel and click on the bell icon to get notified of new videos. Hey peeps, what's up? Manchi here, back with another video. And in this video, I'm going to show you how you can switch between stable and beta versions of MIUI 10 on your Xiaomi Poco F1 with the locked bootloader. Let us first go into settings, go into about phone and as you can see right now I am running MIUI 10.2.3.0 stable based on Android 9.0 Pi. What are the things which we need? You need to download the beta ROM from the website which is linked in the description of this video. Once you open the URL you will have two options to download either the stable ROM or the developer ROM. If you want to switch from stable to beta, which is what we're doing right now, you have to click on developer ROM. And if you want to go back from beta to stable ROM, then you will click on the stable ROM. Once you've downloaded the appropriate ROM, it will be downloaded as a zip file and it will be in the download folder. So let us go into file manager. And there, as you can see right now, I have MIUI, Poco Global 9.3.28, which is the beta version at the time of recording this video. Once you've done these things, we need to go into settings, go into about phone, make sure you are connected to the internet, click on system update, and then we need to click on the 10 seven times. We have an option additional update features are on. Now we will click on the three dot menu on the top right of the screen, and then click on choose update package now we need to scroll to the folder where we have our beta rom so we will click on download we will select this guy make sure you this is checked and then click on ok at the bottom of your screen at this point the updater process will connect to the internet and verify the integrity of the zip file so as you can see right now it is telling me that i am going to revert to a mui version of global 9.3.28 and your personal data will be erased make sure you have backed up everything now in case you do not get this warning that means that your data will not be erased however if you get this warning your data will be erased so right now it is up to you whether you want to proceed further or not in my case i'm making this video i don't actually care about my data so we'll go ahead and click on erase and update it is giving me the same warning one more time so we will click on erase and update one more time as you can see now it is decrypting the zip file once it has verified or decrypted the zip file the phone will reboot automatically and your beta installation update process will start automatically as well and there it is now we are installing miui beta on our xiaomi poco f1 do note this process will take some time so you have to be patient also make sure you do not reboot your device in the middle of the process another thing to make sure is that you have your battery charged at least 60 to 70 percent before you do this update another thing which i would like to mention while we are updating to the beta build is that you have two kind of betas for miui 10. one is a closed beta and one is a public beta what we are applying right now is a public beta because we downloaded it from a publicly available xiaomi website if you ever get your hands on a closed beta I mean it is pretty easy to get the link but a closed beta you cannot apply through the system updater for that you need to have an unlocked bootloader and to a recovery installed if you try to install a closed beta using the updater process which we used right now you will get an error message that you know it is a closed beta and it is only applicable to people who have applied or who are testers of closed beta miui 10. All right, peeps, the installation process for MIUI 10 beta has finished successfully and a POCO F1 is now rebooting. I'll go ahead, skip the initial setup and then be back. So here we are back into MIUI 10. I skipped all the setup. Let's go into settings, go into about phone. And as you can see, we have successfully installed MIUI 10 9.3.28 beta. And we did, however, lose all our data but we were informed about it beforehand by xiaomi so this is how you go from stable miui 10 to beta miui 10 
Next, we will see how you can switch from beta MIUI 10 to stable MIUI 10 with the locked bootloader. All right, peeps, we will now see how you can switch from beta MIUI 10 to stable MIUI 10 with the locked bootloader. Let's first go into settings, go into about phone. And as you can see, right now I am running MIUI 10 global beta 9.3.28. Now the first thing which we need to do is go to the website which is linked in the description of this video. Once you open the website, you will be greeted with this page. And here we need to download the stable ROM. So you click on stable ROM and it will download the latest stable ROM for the Xiaomi Poco F1 on your phone at the time of recording this video. The version of the latest stable ROM is 10.2.3.0 Once we have downloaded the latest stable ROM, we will go into settings, go into about phone and here you need to make sure that you are connected to the internet because the integrity of the zip file which we have downloaded. Let me show you the zip file. Let's go into file manager, click on archives and this is the zip file which was downloaded. You have the version number 10.2.3.0 in the building. Click on the home button settings about phone, go into system update, make sure you're connected to the internet, click on the three dot menu on the top right, and then click on choose update package. Now we need to navigate to the folder where we have downloaded the stable ROM for the Xiaomi Poco F1. Because we downloaded it on the phone, it is in the download folder, click on this guy, and then click on the circle right beside the name to make sure it is checked. Then click on the OK button at the bottom of your screen. At this point, the update process will verify the integrity of the zip file and if your data is going to be wiped, it will give you a message. So there we have it. We have a message that we are moving to MIUI 10.2.3.0 stable and it will erase our data. In my case, I don't have anything to backup, but if you have anything to backup, this is the point where you need to back those things up. I will go ahead and click on erase and update. It will give me the warning one more time that all my pictures, videos will be erased. I will click on erase and update one more time. At this point, the zip file will be decrypted. Once the decryption is successful, the phone will reboot and start applying the stable MIUI 10 ROM on a Xiaomi Poco F1. So there it is peeps. Stable MIUI 10 is being installed on a Xiaomi Poco F1. The process will take some time, so you have to be patient. Another thing to note is that do not reboot your device while the stable ROM is being installed and also make sure that your battery is charged at least 60 to 70 percent. Once the process has finished successfully, I will skip the initial setup and be back to show you that we are on the latest stable build for the Xiaomi Poco F1. Back into MIUI after skipping all the initial setup, let's go into settings, go into about phone and as you can see we are back on MIUI 10.2.3.0 stable based on Android 9.0 Pi. So that's it for this video peeps. We went from MIUI 10.2.3.0 stable to MIUI 10 beta 9.3.28 and then back to MIUI 10.2.3.0 stable with a locked bootloader. I hope my video helped you. Likes, shares and subscribes are appreciated. Feedback and comment more than welcome. See you when I see you.